Domestic accidents need thorough policing. Get statements off everybody. Yes, sir. Then we can get on to the real murders. <laughs> Hello. What's the press doing here? Anything for the South London press, Gov? No, no suspicious circumstances whatsoever. Just, Just a happy family occasion that's gone tragically wrong. Nothing in it for you boys at all, I'm afraid. Go on, love. Have a glass of this. Where's Lucy? She's back at Miss Pringles. Alone. Billy dumped her for Hilda. I hope it's all right. going to be in theatre for a little while yet. I want to stay. When do you think I'll have a chance to get a statement from him? Well, he'll be heavily sedated till the morning. Mm. Is he going to be all right? Tell me he's going to be all right, Monty. can see a little thing like a bullet keeping Billy in the sack for long. So, Lucy and he didn't in Hong Kong. He came back to tell me you loved me. And I shot him. These things happen. Not to other people. <laughs> I told you not to fiddle with that gun. It's a death trap. Sorry, you know what I mean. I shot him on purpose. Don't be daft. What do you mean you shot him on purpose? I thought he was philandering. Who with? Lucy! I thought I saw them and... I mean, he told me he loved me and... other people and you weren't here. Oh, Monty. What's been going on? <laughs> Come on, Hills, what's been happening inside that head of yours? So, Mr. Brooker, if, uh, if you feel up to it, let's run through the events of last evening. I said, oh, where's that old gun? We can buff it up, give it to Winston as a present. We were chasing each other around, just on fooling, really. And I saw the gun over there on the windowsill. The gun was in the, uh, wardrobe. At the bottom of some shoes. I picked it up and pointed it at him. Only as a joke. It was an accident. As soon as she took the gun out of the wardrobe, went off. An accident. They're both lying. Guns don't go off by accident. I think we've got an attempted murder here. <laughs> I can feel it in my water. <laughs> lovely, lovely flowers are now on sale. These everlasting gifts are perfect for any occasion. Get 
as if I'm not here. I'll just put the tray down and be off. I've put a few gypsy creams on the tray. I'd be grateful if you didn't want for a lot. I'm not being tight, just a pensioner. <laughs> I know why you're here. It's about the pornography, isn't it? The pornography? <laughs> I heard the expression, blood is thicker than water. That's the plant. Everyone was wary of that Billy. No one liked him. He's got the evil eyes, see? What about Hilda? Wouldn't let a fly our Hilda. Never would. Never could. suspect. No! How could they? Then why'd they call me in? They talk to everyone. They talk to me. They talk to you round at your place. It'll be all right. Of course it will. We'll leave her to stew in her own juice for a couple of hours. Maybe then we'll get some semblance of the truth out of her. Wish we could do something. It's been hours. You know Hilda in secret. She's bound to crack. The first chance she gets to be really happy. I swap places with her. What'd that prove? I care as much about Hilda as you do. Do you? It's my cock up in the first place. I... I wanna... I, I deserve to go down for it. I wanna tell him it was me. The triplets. I can't cut one of us off. What do you mean, how? I just picked up the gun and shot him. He'd nick my bird. It happens the world over. Crime caramel. Crime... Crime passionel. Hilda's trying to save me from a life in the slammer, but I can't take the guilt anymore. Lock me up and let her out and throw away the key. 